Honda is set to announce the closure of its Swindon car plant in 2022, with the loss of about 3,500 jobs. The Japanese company made 160,000 Honda Civics in Swindon last year, of which some 90% were exported to the EU. Honda has yet to make a formal announcement, and the Prime Minister's spokesman said Theresa May would not comment until an official confirmation. But local MP Justin Tomlinson said he had spoken to Honda, which confirmed it was consulting with all staff. There is not expected to be any job losses, or changes in production until 2021, Mr Tomlinson said. The United Union said the reports, if confirmed, would be a shattering body blow. National Officer Day Quinn said, the car industry in the UK over the last two decades has been the jewel in the crown for the manufacturing sector, and now it has been brought low by the chaotic Brexit uncertainty created by the rigid approach adopted by Prime Minister Theresa May. As well as having a grave impact on workers and their families, it will also affect thousands of jobs in the extensive supply chain across the country, he said. A spokesman for Prime Minister Theresa May said it was only right that we wait until the company has spoken with the workforce before commenting. The International Trade Secretary, Liam Fox, also declined to comment directly until an official announcement. But he pointed out that car demand had fallen since new diesel emissions rules were introduced across Europe. That big drop in demand by consumers is bound to have a knock-on effect with producers, he said. Martin Huggins, a Honda worker for 25 years said, We haven't heard anything at all all we have seen is what is on our phones.